I'm Garrett Kisseberth from Coyer Austin High School. Growing up, I was always the weird kid. I was a 185 pound sixth grader. Everyone called me fat. I was shy. I only had two friends. And coming back from sixth grade summer into my seventh grade year, I made a drastic change. And all of a sudden, everyone wanted to be my friend. I quickly jumped into a relationship that wasn't centered around my faith in Christ. That lasted on and off for two years, and then I went on the Dare to Share retreat with my youth group. I came back and realized this wasn't right for me, so I ended the relationship. It took a while for me to get my own thoughts out of my head. I felt like I didn't deserve God's grace and forgiveness for the mistakes of my life. I had recently been nominated by my teachers at school to be the first leader of the FCA at Coyer Austin. I felt guilty and thought I couldn't be the one to lead these kids, but one morning when I got in my car before school, I found a Bible verse on my seat that my mom had left in there. Joshua 1.9 says, Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. Be strong, Garrett. You made it through these obstacles. God is ready to use you as a messenger for him now. Do not be afraid to share his word and your experience. Reading that note was a sign from God himself. As soon as I got to school, I talked to Mrs. McFarland, our FCA advisor, and I told her I was ready to leave. I was ready to show and tell of God's love and grace as a three-sport athlete I knew leading the FCA, FCA would require a change in actions, on and off the field. I was finally getting my life together as I had tried four years previous. Our FCA started in 2015 with 11 kids. Today we have an average of 21 students show up eager to hear about God's Word. Oftentimes I will find myself having face-to-face -face conversations with kids who think they're not good enough. Though it pained me to share my story at first, now I understand it was all part of God's plan. He put me through the hardships he did so I could connect to the other Corey Austin students and use my experience to shine his light.